Hello and welcome to this session. In this session, we'll discuss a question which says that write the function, that is this quadratic function, given by y is equal to 2x square plus 12x plus 11 in vertex form. Find its axis of symmetry and the vertex. Also find that whether the vertex is maximum or minimum point. Now before starting the solution of this question, we should know a result. And that is, vertex form of quadratic function is given by y is equal to a into x minus h whole square plus k where periods of vertex are given by h, k and axis of symmetry is given by equation x is equal to h. Now this result will work out as a key idea for solving out the given question. Now let us start with the solution of the given question. Now here we are given quadratic function y is equal to 2x square plus 12x plus 11 and we have to write it in vertex form and from the key idea we know that vertex form of quadratic function is given by this equation. For this we will make its perfect square and write it in the form y is equal to a into x minus h whole square plus k. Now we have quadratic function y is equal to 2x square plus 12x plus 11. Now to make its perfect square in the first step we will make coefficient of x square 1. So here we will take 2 common from the right hand side. So it will be y is equal to 2 into x square plus 6x plus 11 by 2 the whole. Now here coefficient of x is 6 its half is equal to 1 by 2 into 6 that is equal to 3 and square of half the coefficient of x is equal to 3 square that is equal to 9 now, we will add and subtract square of half the coefficient of x, that is 9, inside the bracket to make perfect square. So we have y is equal to 2 into x square plus 6x plus 11 by 2 plus 9 minus 9 the whole. Now this implies y is equal to 2 into, now here we will combine these three terms and it will be x square plus 6x plus 9 the whole and we will combine these three terms so it will be plus of 11 by 2 minus 9 the whole and this complete whole. Now this implies y is equal to 2 into x square plus now 6x can be written as 2 into x into 3 plus 9 can be written as 3 square the whole plus now we are taking LCM it will be 11 minus 18 whole upon 2 the whole and this complete whole now we know that a plus b whole square is equal to a square plus 2ab plus b square. 
and we will use this formula here. So this implies y is equal to 2 into x plus 3 whole square plus of 11 minus 18 that is minus 7 upon 2 the whole and this complete whole and this implies now again we will open the brackets so it will be y is equal to 2 into x plus 3 whole square plus 2 into minus 7 upon 2 the whole further this implies y is equal to 2 into x plus 3 whole square minus 7 thus we have made its perfect square and this is the vertex form of the function Now, from the key idea, we know that this is the vertex form of quadratic function where coordinates of vertex are given by hk and axis of symmetry is given by the equation x is equal to h. So here, in this vertex form of the given quadratic function, we have h is equal to minus 3 and k is equal to minus 7 and axis of symmetry is given by the equation x is equal to h that is x is equal to minus 3 so coordinates of vertex are given by minus 3 minus 7 and axis of symmetry is given by the equation x is equal to minus 3. Now here you can see a is equal to 2 which is greater than 0. Thus the graph of given function will open upwards and vertex is the minimum point so this is the solution of the given question. That's all for the session. Hope you all have enjoyed the session.